here with LMU's Anthony Ireland. And first of all, congratulations on your win today, second win of the tournament. You guys struggled coming into the tournament a little bit, but what have you been doing right in these last two games? You know, I mean, I just feel like we're staying together as a team. You know, we're doing, we're really emphasizing, emphasizing on the little things, you know, coaches telling us in the locker room, make sure you communicate on defense, you tag your man on defense, just knowing all our, all our positions and knowing their tendencies and knowing what they're going to do pretty much, knowing the scout. How much do you feel like momentum has been a factor for you today and yesterday? Oh, yeah, I mean, definitely momentum has a factor in it, but I feel like we're just being extra positive now. I mean, I feel like just the way it feels to have the feeling of winning or go home is just you're on the edge, you know, so might as well just have no regrets and give it all you got every time you're out there. So, I mean, we just have to keep playing like that and keep pulling for each other. And you guys came into this tournament kind of almost with nothing to lose, but what has yeah. that done for you mentally? Does it give you kind of an edge, just go out there, have fun, do your best? Yeah, I mean, yeah, exactly what I said. Just stay positive. You know, we're playing for our seniors, Taylor Walker and Ashley Hamilton, and we're just trying to make them last, make their career last as long as possible. And this game went into overtime. You guys have lost some close games lately over the season, but what were you guys saying in the huddle? What were you saying to your teammates, and what was the mentality going into that overtime period? Just emphasizing on like winning, winning time, and that's what, that's what we've been saying the last couple of minutes. And just st staying positive, really, just staying together. And just, I, w I mean, I'm trying to do a better job being a more vocal leader. And um, I mean, it's been working. You guys have Santa Clara tomorrow. What do you see in that team? What are the challenges that, that come with facing that team? You know, I mean, obviously they have, I mean, they have three three pieces: Treslini, Rockamore, and Foster, who all three are very very good threats. So I mean, we we're, we we know them. We played them. We beat them. Actually, we beat them in conference. So I mean, we owe them one, and I feel like it's going to be a great matchup. All right, thanks so much, and we will have more interviews throughout the week on CampusInsiders.com.